Hey guys, this is Carl Tucker from FYI Reviews and How To's, and today we're going to talk about torque converter shutter caused by the MDS system. That's that's right, you heard me right. Torque converter shutter caused by the MDS system on a 2006 Dodge Charger Daytona RT with the 5.7. So stay tuned, and we'll be right back. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, and uh, as I said before, we're going to be talking about torque converter shutter caused by the MDS system on a 2006 Dodge Charger Daytona uh, with the 5, RT, RT with the 5.7 uh, Hemi in it. Uh, we, I've had this car for a while, and I've had issues with the torque converter shutter as you're as you're decelerating the car so you want like when you if you pull up to a stop sign as you're applying let off your gas and you're applying your brake and you're decelerating down through 30 mile an hour 25 mile an hour and 20 mile an hour uh, it developed a, a pretty bad torque converter shutter and then as the car come closer to a stop the shutter would stop just suddenly all of a sudden like like the torque converter just unlocked and uh um I, I, I did a lot of things. I, I, I changed the transmission fluid, changed the filter. Normally in some of the old cars that would solve the problem. Didn't solve the problem here. Uh, I went and bought some special torque, uh, torque converter shutter stuff and poured it down in the transmission. That didn't work. Uh, I was on the verge of pulling the transmission and replacing the torque converter. And uh, uh, when I had my... Uh, uh, I have a Diablo tuner, and uh, I, have, I have it in my box right here. Um, when I decided I was going to do some adjustments on the tune, and uh, um, I had no idea that the MDS system had a, uh, a link with this sh the shutter, that there was some kind of, that the MDS system might have been calling, causing this torque converter shutter. Uh, I just wanted to turn off the MDS because... I just want it to have a, uh, a better throttle response. Uh, there's a lot of other issues that goes on with this MDS system. So I just want it to shut it off for those reasons. Uh, but what I found, once I shut it off, the torque converter shutter went away. And uh, so I, I started looking out and research this online. And uh, uh, this is a known issue with the um, MDS system having problems unlocking the torque converter when it decelerates through uh, uh, lower speeds. Lower speeds. There's actually, uh, what I understood, you could take the car to the dealership and uh, they could reflash your uh, computer and uh, put new software in that uh, stops that from happening. But I didn't want the MDS in anyway, and I, so I took it off. Uh, have much better throttle response because you're running on eight cylinders all the time. It really has not changed my my gas mileage that much. So you have to really weigh: is it worth having the MDS uh, in compared to the troubles that it could cause? Uh, I don't think so because the MDS system, when it shuts off two cylinders on each head, your aluminum heads, as you're going down the road it'll heat up at different rates. In other words, the two uh, uh, non-running cylinders will be much cooler than the two cylinders that are running. Uh, so it heats up unevenly, and, and it's heating up unevenly on an aluminum head. That aluminum head has uh, steel valve seats in it, and uh, those valve seats are notorious on these things for dropping out. And when they drop out, it's catastrophic. It, it, it is a major, it's a rebuild. So uh, um, one of the things that kind of help prevent that for ha from happening is to shut off the MDS so the heads are heating up and, and cooling down at the same rate evenly. 
And uh, that was one of my reasons. The other reason is much better th throttle response. If you're true, if you're cruising down the road 60, 65 mile an hour, and you hit that gas, that thing goes. So, uh, uh, and it it doesn't affect the the fuel economy that much. So, um, yeah, with the get low gas prices, I turned it off, and I, I intend on keeping it off. But so, guys, if you're having that 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 uh, a torque converter shutter problem. Try turning off that MDS and see if that takes care of your problem. It sure did for me. Just uh, And that was a cheap fix. Didn't cost me anything other than this tuner, which I have for my car anyway. Again, guys, this is Carl Tuck with FYI Reviews and How-Tos. And if this video helped you out, please hit that like button. Please hit that bell button so that you'll be notified every time I load up a new video. And by all means, please help a fella out and hit that subscribe button. I'm trying to get to a thousand su subscribers so I can get my channel monetized and everything. So help a fella out, guys. Till next time, love each and every one of you. See you later. Bye.